to welcome everyone this afternoon to join us for this great and should I say surprising event and to thank you for all braving the heat. Uh, it, I want to say that I've worked for Craig for almost six years now and it's been an honor and a privilege. Everyone knows why we're here today and Craig you will find out very soon. <laughs> And no, it's not because you just celebrated your 61st birthday last week, but we wish you a very happy birthday. And no, it's not because you just recently added your 400th connection on LinkedIn, <laughs> but it's an impressive achievement. Uh, we're here to celebrate and honor Craig for his leadership and to recognize years of dedication towards investing in the future of public service through providing competent, ethical administration and effective local government management. As management guru Peter Drucker noted, effective leadership is not about making speeches or being liked. Leadership is defined by results, not attributes. The results celebrated today are due to Craig's philosophy in placing significant time and investment into the next generation of public administrators and taking the opportunity to build the foundation, the character, and the competency of young people so that they can go out and effectively serve local communities. Craig's always been a huge supporter of providing internship experiences to talented individuals seeking to make a difference in public service, whether it be a student working to complete their graduate degree or undergrad degree, or a mid-career professional branching out to a new path, Craig or Dr. Waldron, has been the consummate teacher in instilling the value of real life experiences. We all know the Oakdale intern because the Oakdale intern is always with Craig. <laughs> it's been such a regular part of the scene that if you recall, a couple years back, the city management circles, we even sang a song about it at the holiday event, thanks to Mike Erickson and Richard Fersman. Throughout his significant personal and professional accomplishments, Craig has constantly had a steady stream of interns by his side. Since starting early in his career, he's had more than 20, I think we're almost up to 30 individuals who have studied under him and learned about public service through experiential learning. He's had a passion for sharing knowledge gained from showing how to go about conducting everyday city operations. In addition, this list of talented members of the next generation continues to grow. He's continually encouraging those around him to share those experiences, both as his role as city administrator and teaching at a number of graduate programs around here in the metro. He not only talks the talk, he walks the walk, and he shows people firsthand what it's like to walk a mile in his shoes. But what has he accomplished? This has helped to build initial skill sets, not only allowed people to put that great talking point of serving at the city of Oakdale on their resume, but also providing those vital experiences to young individuals to have a working knowledge to go out to other cities and counties and make a difference by provi providing quality, effective, and efficient services to local communities. Now, Craig is always one that is quick to point out that public service is not Wilson or Jefferson 101. There's no textbook that can fully prepare you for every challenge or problem. This is real life where context matters and you need the experience and need to experience an event to better understand how to effectively and how to capably serve residents, local businesses, and our communities. In addition, Craig's leadership to develop the next generation, both by encouraging department heads and, and through his um, efforts as city administrator, has produced a number of full-time staff here at Oakdale who have diligently uh, and work diligently to serve the needs of the community and to carry out important city council priorities with skill, determination, and dedication. A number of them are here today, both from Oakdale and now those who are ser serving nearby communities. Each one of them, including myself, have been significantly impacted because we've had a chance to share in the experiences and to learn how, firsthand just how important Craig values what we do and to recognize how he has individually challenged each and every one of us to perform constantly at the highest level each and every day. And so why are we gathered here today? We're here to <laughs> celebrate <laughs> both a national and even international recognition of his tireless dedication 
to give back not only to the profession, but to honor the fact that Craig has made such a significant and long-lasting impact on so many people. Robert Louis Stevenson said, don't judge each day by the harvest you reap, but by the seeds that you plant. Throughout the years, a great number of communities in the Twin Cities and greater Minnesota and in the Midwest region have benefited from Oakdale interns taking on new roles as assistants, as full city administrators, as community development directors, as economic development directors, as city planners, as well as served in areas such as park and recreation, building inspections, engineering, code enforcement, and public safety. Craig has planted the seeds that have already produced great results and that will continue to do so for decades to come. He's done this by instilling a sense of responsibility into all those that he works with to carry on his dedication and passion forward to the next generation. And now I'd like to turn it over to our mayor, Carmen Serac, to say a few words and to let Craig know exactly why we're here today <laughs> celebrating his great accomplishment and award. Thank you, Dave. Well, quite a history, isn't it? Awesome. Well, these are his official resignation papers that I want to read before we sign them. No, I'm kidding you. <laughs> you can breathe easier, Craig. Uh, I am proud and honored to announce the International City County Managers Association has selected Oakdale City Administrator Craig Waldron to receive the 2011 award for career development in honor of L.P. Cockingham. Craig was chosen for the significant contribution he has made to the development of new interns in the professional local government management. The award will be presented to Craig at the ICMA's annual conference held this September in Milwaukee. On behalf of the City Council, City staff, past interns, and Oakdale re residents, I wish to congratulate Craig on this tremendous accomplishment. Craig, could you, could you please come forward? This is a certificate of recognition to Craig Waldron for being selected to receive the ICMA's 2011 Award for Career Development. Congratulations, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm stunned. I'm absolutely stunned. Jeez. And I can't believe how all of this can go on. I don't have a clue. Unreal. <laughs> absolutely unreal. Jeez. Just a tip the iceberg. Someone else is new, huh? Oh. Now, was that a real project today? Fox no. got me out there in the heat, walking around, and trailing everything else, and getting soaked out there, and I'm crapping about the heat, and now I know. So, yeah. um, thank goodness we had the television show this morning, so at least I have a tie on, Frank. And, oh, boy. Uh, well, I'm, I'm just totally taken by surprise. I'm, I'm honored. Uh, there's so many people that I've uh, worked with over over the years. You know, I certainly thank my family for backing me on all of this. Joe. <laughs> Whit. <laughs> Liam. Jojo. So uh, just to have a supportive family has been uh, incredible. I've been uh, blessed with excellent city council members. Um, uh, who would have thought I would have been here 18 years, but you can just you see the type of council that I've worked with over time and the series of consuls, so I've been uh, fortunate there. And then last but not least, to have a great set of uh, colleagues that I work with, and God, I'm just honored to see all of you here, and uh, just outstanding staff, you know, our department heads all the way through the whole organization are uh, just outstanding. And uh, 
I certainly wouldn't be here if it uh, wasn't for you. And last of all, I just uh, thank and congratulate all those uh, interns that I've uh, uh, worked with over time and that are out there making a difference now and everything else, just, uh, just incredible. So thank you. I'm just, I'm blown away. Incredible. Thanks. <laughs>